All right, I am now going to make a new folder and put it over here on the left side here, along with all the uh, other folders and songs I've got here. So what we're going to do is go over to songs. We're on a new folder. Boom, there it is, it shows up. And you can rename that by clicking on it. Swiping it right there, putting, I don't know, whatever you want. My gig songs. Just like that. All right. Now, what we're going to do is then import a song into that. You want to make sure that's highlighted. So, when you go to import a song, it knows where to go to. <laughs> that's very important. Because otherwise, you have no idea where it's going to go to on this whole list right here. So, highlight it. Oops. Just like that. Go back up to file. Go to import. In this case, we want to import a song. And then go to the folder where the song is located. Your choice of wherever you keep your songs at, whichever one you want imported. Go to that one. Go to that. In my case, it's uh, Beat Buddy stuff, gig songs. And here's my list. And I want to bring in Stormy Monday. So what you do is you double click on that and boom there it shows up right there. And that's it. And then when you've got your Beat Buddy pedal plugged in you want to hit synchronize projects so anything changes you make on this manager program is going to be shoved into the Beat Buddy pedal and then there you go. That's all you got to do. And that's it for uh, making a new folder and uh, importing a song. And this is as of November 27th, 2016. And this is with the latest um, software in the Beat Buddy Manager and the Beat Buddy Paddle. So there you have it. Thank you.